you would maybe support a third party, a, a freedom party, if you will. What's the status with that? Well, it's certainly not my first choice. Uh, you know, the Republican Party is the party of Lincoln and Reagan, and the planks in the platform are right for this country. I stand strong on those planks. I just wish that more of our leadership, the movers and shakers within the party, would uh, stand strong on those planks with the rest of us, those who, you know, want to, to stop Barack Obama's transformation of America. And the way that we do that is by staying true to our principles. So, no, those who are kind of capitulating and, and caving and giving in to Obama and what the, the mainstream media would want um, from politicians, it gets frustrating and it tempts one to believe that um, if they in the party abandon us, we have um, no other choice. But it's not the first choice to, to go there. You know, it's kind of the way I... ...for America. Well, there's been talk you might run for senator in Alaska. Have, have you considered that at all? Um, I've considered it because people have requested me considering it. But um, I, I'm still waiting to see, you know, what the lineup will be and hoping that uh, there again there will be some new blood, some new energy, not just kind of picking from the same old politicians in the state that uh, come from political families that have sort of brained up there for so many years because... Too many of them have been part of the problem, but I'm glad you brought that up because Senator Mark Begich has got to be replaced. He has not done what he has promised to do for the people of Alaska, and that was to represent what it is that the nation needs in terms of energy development and, and uh, so many other natural resource uh, development issues that are near and dear to an Alaskan heart. Because he's on the wrong side of the aisle, he has to go along to get along with his Democrat leadership and that's a shame. That is a waste of opportunity for our nation. If you think that whoever's running doesn't have the ability to win, would, and you think you could, would that propel you into the race, do you think? Well, I think any, any American with, with a heart for service has to always have in the back of their mind that they would do anything, everything that they could to help the cause, even if perhaps if it's something that doesn't look necessarily appealing or necessarily fitting in with a, a conventional plan that they would uh, try to orchestrate for themselves and their family. I, along with anybody, would have to say that I would do whatever I could to help. And, uh, you know, if, if that yeah. was part of that help, then it would have to be considered.